Hi, it's Beth with your little bit of Beth. Just a little snippet that's going to help you, I don't know, maybe reframe your work day, uh, have more ease and comfort in your workspace, be able to help others be able to support you and your goals. And that's what I'm going to talk about today. So this morning, I was on a coaching call with a new client who's new to an organization. And he was telling me about one of the things he used in the past that really helped manage up. It helped him help his supervisor to interact with him better and frankly, to help him have more restful weekends. And this is the key. His supervisor was one of those people that on Friday afternoon, he finally frantically would sit down and go through all the thoughts in his head and all the questions that he had, and he'd start shooting emails out to people. And they'd be dropping in their inbox on Friday afternoon at, I don't know, between 3 and 5 o'clock. Sometimes they wouldn't even drop in the inbox until late in the day. And so my client would potentially, I don't know, decide to check his email on Saturday afternoon or Sunday night to get ready for the week. And all of a sudden he'd realize that he had all these questions and it just was a bump in his weekend and it didn't feel great. And so what he started doing was this thing that he called um, pre-week thinking. And what that entailed is he would block out dedicated time on Thursday afternoon when he would send his boss an email that said, these are the five things I got done this week, and these are the five things that I'm going to be focused on for next week. Just a bullet list, nothing more than that. And what it would do would be give his boss the answers to the questions that were going to pop into his head on Friday when he was getting ready to exit for the week. And it helped my client avoid getting those bothersome, disruptive emails that were full of questions. I think you understand where I'm going with this. We've talked, if you've been in any of my workshops and if you've read my materials in the past, we've talked about um, end of day work, which is your opportunity to spend 15 or 20 minutes preparing yourself so that when you walk in in the morning, the first task you're going to jump into is all ready to go. You don't have to spend that time digging around, getting materials together, deciding where to start. You're ready to jump right in because you took care of that the night before, before you left. Now we're adding a step to that, which is helping to prepare your boss so that he or she won't be interrupting your weekend with their last minute questions. So you can get the downtime you need and they can have the answers they're looking for. Isn't that kind of a great idea? I thought it was fabulous. Um, I'm going to start doing that. Oh, wait a minute. I'm my own boss. So that means I would be emailing myself. But you know what? I'm thinking that might not be a bad idea. All right. There you have it. Your little bit of Beth for today. And remember, if you want to be able to work with Beth Watson and Company, um, we have got some great consultants joining our team. Our coaching capacity is expanding. And so just send us an email, support at bethwanson.com. Let us know what's challenging you, how you want to engage, what we can help you with, and let's get going. All right. Can't wait to talk to you soon. Bye.